You gotta look at all of your assets once it hits. Soldiers from the 11th Armored Cavalry Regiment met with clinical psychologists from Aurora Behavioral Healthcare at the National Training Center in order to give them a better understanding of the stress they face upon entering a combat environment. Not necessarily. What will happen is they'll go out there and they'll get the AR. The psychologist observed a combat observation point attack and a situational training exercise during their visit. I think one of the things that we experienced these past few days was a better understanding of what the soldiers go through when they're in this training area. Many of them will talk to us about that and now instead of just hearing what they say, we can actually envision having experienced some of it for ourselves. One of the things that we noticed, I think, was that there's a definite um, problem with transitioning from into sort of a battle mind back to a family mode or back to uh, a more normal situation. And that's something that I think is unique to this space and also to this training area, but it's also a similar replicated experience that they have coming back from deployment. So we're going to use that information to help increase their ability to cope with those stressors, how to handle those stressors, and how to keep them going back into the training area that they need to do. I think this was an invaluable experience for myself and my team to get first-hand experience of, of what they're going through. It really does give a deeper level of insight into what's happening on all sorts of different realms. I would hope that behavioral health would be uh, much more of a part of, of the future of the Army, and certainly them, I think it's an, an important part. Preventative care is always better than cure, so the more that we can uh, be involved at the front end so that these problems don't arise in the first place, I think. And for me, that's the future of behavioral health. Reporting from Fort Irwin, California, I'm Army Specialist Nathaniel Muth.